everyone. Uh, this tutor tutorial is going to try to explain how to remove the gold 50th anniversary Daytona items from the SPP Daytona tracks. I've decided to make this a uh, combined tutorial for both uh, day and night versions since it is relatively the same track. So what I'm going to show first is the day version. And I've already gone ahead and separated out the items because as you, as some of you may know, when you download the track from the SPP website, those items are already included in there. So in order to remove those and return like the walls, uh, start finish line, victory lane, particularly in the day version, uh, since it has more items than the night, be at the 50th running of the Daytona 500. Uh, these items right here that I have already separated out I included the track mat and six other MIPS. Those items need to be removed uh, in order to revert back, as I said, to uh, no gold and just the black Daytona on the walls, uh, black and white checkered start finish line, and so on. There is also a file that's available that will apply the dark. Uh, black, I should say, text onto the main grandstand and the front stretch and the press box also on the back stretch. As you'll notice, if you remove the 50th anniversary items, there will be nothing there. So there is a file that's available uh, as, you, as you go to download either track, uh, either day or night, uh, that will apply the black Daytona text across the main grandstand on the front stretch and the one on the back stretch. If you so choose to download those, those are there available there for you to do so. For the night version, I'll show that real quick. There's less items in that as I was already previously mentioned. When you go into the night version, available at the SPP website. Um, it applies a track mat, which is the same as the day, but there's only two loose MIPS. Uh, that includes grand build, grand underscore build without the D, and top build. Again, if you remove those items, just simply remove those items from the Daytona Night SPP BR track, it will not have any Daytona text on either press box on the front stretch, main grandstand, or on the back stretch. So there is that file uh, mentioned or whatever that it's an executable. It'll put the all you have to do is download it, and it'll put it exactly where it needs to go. And that's pretty much all there is to that. Uh, I could show you. Right quickly, what I am speaking about. I'm just going to go into sandbox real quick. This is on the night version. So what'll happen? What what <clears throat> what this removal uh, will do will obviously put the Daytona on the walls, the black. Then it says as you uh, initially downloaded, those will be gold, and it'll be gold up on the uh, main grandstand pre press box in the front stretch. Uh, as you can see, there's nothing here. That's the way this removal will show that there. Uh, so as I said, there is a file that's available to apply Daytona text to that item there as well as the bat one on the back stretch. Way over there.
and I hope this explains a little bit more details as far as uh, how to accomplish that. Uh, the removal of the gold 50th anniversary Daytona items. And I thank you for watching.